hello, my name is Francisco Javier Guerrero Gonzalez and I'm a research uh, fellow here at the Luxembourgish company MANA Electric in a joint project called Explore with the Technical University of Munich. So over 50 years since we got back for the first time uh, to the moon, interest is growing, but there are still challenges to be assessed to go, not only to be, but to stay. Uh, bringing everything from Earth, it's uh, still very expensive. <clears throat> Using resources on the moon is considered one of the best uh, ways of saving uh, hardware development costs, but also launch costs and therefore reducing the, the expensive of uh, lunar space exploration. Research scientists are investing significant effort on transforming or adapting terrestrial processing technologies in order to be able to work in the harsh lunar environment and in order to be able to process the resources that are available there. And this is where my research comes in. I'm working on transforming moon dust, also known as regolith, into oxygen and metals so that astronauts can live there sustainably and long term without relying on the supply chain from Earth. We are working on molten salt electrolysis, a process inspired by the aluminum industry to produce air resources from, from lunar regolith. We are lowering the operating temperature of the process in order to uh, reduce the energy consumption, but also improve the lifetime of the available hardware. The main challenge is to find salt electrolytes that melt at low enough temperatures, but they still remain stable while processing the lunar soil. Ultimately, this means fewer resupplies from Earth.